moment of the day, the 26 by 14 KG1 Tridents. 10,000 views and we're hooking chains. Yeah, white lightning, buddy. 10,000 views on this video. Hey, cow shit on the day. The paint's filling off where I passed Alex going down the interstate the other day. <laughs> transmission in the back, whatever you need, buddy. He's got a new transmission, but I'm about to drag that. It's 10,000 views and we'll hook chains at the front of Southern Tire. 10,000 views, run it up. Hey. Red gang. That white bow tie. Truck me shit. Truck me nonsense. It's been a while. It's been a, it's been a long time. I don't know the last time you came to one of these. Don't get me started on you. Don't get me started on you. Dude, the last video we made was fucking that bed, your cat eye bed. Was that really? That was that's been a, that's almost a year ago. That wow. Was, that was the round body bed. When you put it back on? Yeah, when we put it on and I um I just put the uh I just put the I just put three inch spindles on the front of the cat eye. Yeah. Oh yeah, I saw you at Southern, right? Y'all haven't y'all haven't seen the cat eye yet. Are they fighting? Oh! Are they fighting? Oh, some kid got rocked. Some kid got rocked. You got me fucked up. You think I'm going over there? I'm not going over there. They're fighting. Okay. I can't. I can't walk around the truck meet one time before they start fucking fighting. God damn it. the tasers and said literally we can't show up for five minutes people are fucking ruining the truck meet but i do want to show you guys the nicest truck out here obviously got your boy rob down there you see southern tire ma making its making its way into the world you got the southern tire truck out here shitting on them and that in that right yes, sir out here shitting on them i don't want to hear nothing from you <laughs> nothing from you dude i make your content 20 times better you can't lie <laughs> bunch of awesome builds that we're, we're running through the shop here at the end of the week. I'm hoping by the end of the video today that you guys will get to see the rose gold wheels. I got a call that they believe they're finished this morning. I'm waiting on the confirmation call here in just a little bit. I want to show you guys the first truck that left today. Literally, the truck's been here for maybe three or four hours. It's ridiculous what some of my guys can get done in the time frame that they can get these done in. We've got a truck coming today from St. Louis that's getting done today. And then we've got a truck that's coming in from Indianapolis that'll be here tomorrow at eight o'clock in the morning. So definitely, uh, definitely a little out of state border war right now, even though they probably don't share a border. But I want to show you guys this beautiful red Silverado that got done this morning. We did a uh, six inch rough country with some 22s and then the, the Ridge Grapplers. You can't beat the Ridge Grapplers, but you guys know that this, this red truck is obviously my favorite color of all of them, even though I say that they're all my favorite, but it's a great way to start off the morning. Rough Country kit, great price, great quality. Oh, I mean, you, you really can't beat the Rough Country. It's a, it's a great option for people that don't want to go huge on a lift kit. We did finish this up earlier the other day. We got some 22 inch TIS wheels, the Gladiators, and then I believe a six inch on the Cat Eye. You guys know I've got a, a little secret, secret spot in my heart for the Cat Eyes. And then uh, we got Brandon's F450 Dually on the 26 inch Four Giados. Uh, my camera work is way off today, chilling out in front today. So we got some awesome builds, awesome, awesome builds 
I don't think I could say awesome anymore in the, in this clip. I need to I need to switch my words up a little bit. I'm trying not to cuss as much either. I know I keep getting more more and more comments as the days go by about cussing, so I'm trying to stop cussing as much. So if you guys hear me cussing, the video is pointed out. My my editing is getting a little bit better on trying to edit out the cuss words. But uh, we got some awesome stuff coming through the shop. St. Louis in the mix today, and then Indianapolis tomorrow. It's gonna be an awesome end to the week, and we got the uh, Southern Tower Saturday this Saturday as well. You ready to be number two? You're coming up here confident eat, eating some McDonald's like you ready to be number number two. On the bright side, yeah, yeah. Yeah. On the bright side, yeah, yeah. Hey. Yeah. One leg out that brand new Benz way. Hometown asking me my wrist, yeah. Repetition from my chest, that's a bench press. Studio, we chillin', are we making hits? Yes, waiting for the next tour. You wish I was piss poor. Saw they getting mad, but what they really getting pissed for? Seeing more behind the frame, future. What are you doing? Get this bread. Big Curtis drove all the way from St. Louis, Missouri. Now, as far as I know, the first build that we've ever done from Missouri, and I'm pretty proud of the first build to come out of that state. And you, you, you know what I'm gonna say. In my opinion, now the nicest truck to ever come out of Missouri or take back to Missouri. But Big Curtis drove all the way down here with his beautiful all white Silverado 26 by 14 TIS 544s in that black and milled. One of the most popular wheels in, on the market right now. Got some 35s and then of course, of course, we can't do any build without that nine inch McGoy's lift kit. That black, that premium black McGoy's lift kit with the billet accent. The, take, take a look at this. You can't tell me that that's not the most beautiful lift kit in the whole world. You can't tell me that's not the most beautiful lift kit in the whole world come on come on now we do so many of these 19 to 21 silverados but come on them 14 to 18s really be popping out on them with the 26s and the mcgoy's lift kit and look at me i'm i'm you know talking crap about myself because i don't even have 26 but you, your boy's gonna pop back out at some point so stop playing around with me but this is one of my let me let me stop playing come on come on let's let's Look, 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 look. We're, we're, gonna, we're gonna kneel down a bit. Let's be honest here. Let's be honest. I say everything's my favorite. Everything's always my favorite, right? I, I have this body style. I wouldn't have this body style if it wasn't partially my favorite a little bit, right? You can't tell me that truck over there don't look just sweet. That's like smack your mama kind of good. Look at that. I'm just, you, can you tell that I'm trying to come up with other stuff instead of cussing? Wasn't, wasn't, isn't it, mom, if you're watching this, I made, I dropped out of college to try not to cuss on camera. That, my, my life goals are on point right now. I gotta stop cussing on camera so I can make some more money. Dropped out of college for that. I'm, I'm just trying to prove to my mom it was a good decision. <laughs> I do need to stop cussing. But hey, let me know what you guys think in the comments of this silver. Damn, Zach. I remember my first time parking a big truck. You might have to, yeah, go to the right a little bit. You're fine. Hey, you're good. It's a beautiful blue color. Big Curtis missed me already. Back again. Amar's got a truck just like this on some 16 wides. Shout out to Amar. Amar, comment something below if you're watching this. Shout out to Amar, buddy. Where are you at? Why are you going to tell me? You know it doesn't look dirty in the video, though. Did you miss me already? You left yesterday, you had to come back and see man, me? You already know, Did you man. miss What's me already? Up? Big Curtis in hey, the cut. You already know, man, straight from St. Louis. What's up with it, with man? With the golds in. You already know, man. I, when, I, when I lived in Tallahassee, I almost got a set for the bottom. I uh, almost yeah. did it, I should have. Man, you know these don't come out, man. You know straight St. Louis, man. Hey, man, y'all know where to come, man. All the way from St. Louis, you see. St. Louis, man, drove nine hours. I'm, I'm gonna have to come. I might have to come pop out up there sometime. Actually, I, somebody somebody messaged me the other day. Said, hey, "When you coming to St. Louis?" I might have to. I might have to make a trip up there. Come on with it, man. You already know it's all love. It's all love. Miss me already? I can't believe it. I mean, I'm cool, but I'm not that cool. You ain't have to come back and see me. Man, I had to, man. <laughs> I couldn't leave without seeing my boy Alex. Come on, man. Hey, you know, I appreciate I appreciate all y'all for coming through and showing love and. Uh, 
You already know, man. I had to come back and see you before I pushed out. That nine hours. I, I say it on I say it on camera all the time, and I'm sure when people see it in the video is different. But it, it blows my mind that people are willing to drive from so far away just you know to get a truck. It's it's an experience. You know, I asked True from Chicago because I, I built a truck from Chicago a couple oh, damn, couple weeks damn. ago, month month or two ago. It's it's the experience, and I, I'm just I'm blessed to be a part of something like this. And I just I appreciate y'all. Same here, so, man. Same here. Like I, I said, we ride big rims, so it's the first thing for me too, it's, man. It's only I right. Love it. I'm, I'm gonna get you back in a in a couple months. Get you some 28. Come on with it, man. Hey, 20, 28's on the way. Y'all stop playing. Leonard, don't nobody care about that raggedy ass white truck of yours. I told you. This hook fucking changed right now. <laughs> Leonard. I swear to God, you pull up right here in front of the shot and get your drone out, and I'll drag that one, then I'll drag that one. Leonard, nope nobody in the comments even likes white lightning. That's okay, your old lady likes my wheels better. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about the comments. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Look, look. Y'all, you seriously can't tell me. Really? Really? Hey. You're messing up my sponsor right now. Paint, paint filling off at all, buddy. You're messing up my sponsor. I ain't got no clear coat left either. Hey, Aerodynamics. You know what my No about clear about coat you. means better aerodynamics. Hey, you know what? I don't need clear coat on the truck. You know why? Shine armor. Shine armor clear coat. Guess what? My windows are darker too, buddy. Shine armor. Fortify quick coat. Quick detailer. I don't need clear coat on the truck. Shine Armor's got me covered. How much you making for this video, bud? I don't make no money off this. Why? Because I love Shine Armor. That's why. I like Matt better. I dropped out of college for this. That's right. What? You would You wouldn't. Shine Armor wouldn't be anything without him. I wouldn't be nothing without Odom's. That's right. Hey, skinny bow tie wouldn't be shitting on Leonard over here without Odom's. I like the one tone better than the two tone. I ain't gonna lie. Dang. Two tone wrong, baby. Guess I'll get it. Two tone Rome, baby. For, on, a, on a real note, shout out to Shine Armor. Me and Shine Armor have been doing work for a little while now. My truck got egged a couple, like a month ago, and Shine Armor slid into my DMs and said, hey look, we saw what's going on. We want you to have a clean truck. We're gonna send you some products. And I've been a fan ever since, to be honest. Shine Armor coming through with the Fortify quick coat for the white lightning. Look, Stop putting stickers all over my truck, put damn it. my bullseye on both your trucks, so I think I'll take them both out, buddy. Hey, you wanna know? I'll never see the bullseye, but you're gonna be looking at them all the time when I'm dusting your ass down the road. I'm glad you put the bullseye on the back so you can watch them as I drive by your ass. I tell you what, you get over <laughs> your fucking video right here, get your drone out, we'll clear the fucking pad. Fortify, quick coat. Shout out to Shine Armor, sp sponsor of today's video. Showing love. Making an old girl look all, all beautiful over there. Y'all can't tell me the two-tone ain't shitting on them. Come on now. I need to stop cussing as much. I get in the moment, I start cussing a bunch. The beginning of the video, I said I'm gonna stop cussing. And here I am, cussing up a storm. This video is gonna be nothing but bleep, 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 bleep. Yeah, Leonard got you fired up. Yeah, oh, come on, man. truck builds, two from out of state, two days, freaking killing it. So yesterday was St. Louis. Shout out to Big Curtis for coming through. One of the nicest dudes. Safe travels back to St. Louis today. And then we got Mr. Al coming through. Al came all the way from Indianapolis to come get this beautiful 
beautiful GMC truck lifted today. 2021 GMC Elevation. This this crazy red color, my favorite red color of any truck is, is I just, I can't even describe how much I love the color of this truck. This is undeniably my favorite color that GM makes. We got the 24 by 12 hostile demons in that beautiful satin black, matte black, satin black, one of the two. I can't remember, we, you know, we do so many wheels, it's hard to keep track all the time. With that 325-45 Nitto Terra Grappler. No better choice of a tire than to run the Nittos. They ride great, no noise, great wet traction, mileage warranty. I mean, it just, you, you can't beat it. We got that six inch Rough Country on there. The, the, this, the Rough Country on this truck, the six inch Rough Country really sits taller than I expected it. A lot of these trucks, you can tell that it's a six. This one almost looks like the seven inch McGoy's to be 100% honest with you. And, it, and I know what it is, it's the diesel. So the Rough Country, normally sits a little bit lower that all the diesels sit a little bit taller i don't know why all the at4s that are diesel even the nine inch they all they all look a little bit taller and i did learn today some of you may notice that that rough country lift on the front doesn't come with the rough Con country emblem and i was told that the diesel models have something in the way so that emblem will not fit on the front cross member so a lot of you guys will see that there's no emblem on the front and that is why the diesel models do not fit for whatever reason i'm not sure that's just what i was told Re regardless it's a it's a beautiful i'm just waiting for somebody to straight pipe one of these one of these diesel 1500s that's what i'm really waiting for i'm, I'm ready for somebody to show up with a diesel that's straight piped got that got that nice diesel sound to it pop up with a 1500 straight pipe rolling coal on them that's that's what i'm that's what i'm waiting for one of the coolest things about this truck that i've never seen on any of the other trucks that we've done is this from the factory or from the dealer one of the two has the light up gmc grill on the front now let me let me grab the keys so maybe we can see this y'all might be able to see it i just backed it into the shade a little bit might be able to see the lights behind there it's got a beautiful look to it these gmc's are, are so amazing that red is just crazy though I love that red. Southern Tire Red right there. That's a that's that's an amazing truck. Like I said, in and out same day, lift kit, wheels, tires, fender modification. Huge shout out to Al for driving all the way from, from Indianapolis to show love to the shop, show love to the channel. Got him hooked up with a bread gang decal and a shirt from the shop. Al, we love you so much. Welcome to the family. Man, it just it's it's amazing some of the things that we can do. That's that's two builds, two days, two states. Hell yeah. He absolutely loves it. He's gonna be hanging out in Atlanta for the weekend too. Just absolutely killing the game in Atlanta. St. Louis and Indianapolis on the road. Another day, another lift kit. Another Jake. What? Another Jake. Another day, another red truck that you don't have. Another red truck that is my favorite. <laughs> How far are you zooming in? Like really far. Does it look good? You do look really good. I can count the, the beards, the beard hairs, the beards. It's a glue on. It's Velcro. I haven't looked at it all day. It's probably all messed up. Hey, guess what? What? I'll see you at the show tomorrow. Okay. Okay. 10,000 views and we're hooking chains. Yeah, white lightning, buddy. 10,000 views on this video. Hey, cow shit on the thing. The paint's filling off while I passed out. It's going down the interstate the other day. <laughs> Transmission in the back. Whatever you need, buddy. He's got a new transmission, but I'm about to drag that ass. 10,000 views, and we'll hook chains at the front of Southern Tire. 10,000 views, run it up. Guys, today is the day. I am gonna be late for work this morning because I have to go pick up all the pieces that are finally rose gold. All of our rose gold pieces are finally finished, and I have to go pick them up this morning. So, I uh, this, is a, this is a big moment. I've seen some pictures, but I, I haven't seen it in person. So, you know, I stopped. Got me the the typical, you know, the, the typical morning routine with a little bit of rose gold added on to it, I guess. <laughs> so this is a new guy. Yeah, it's a new guy. <laughs> Why does he look so wild? I don't know. He's got a weird looking face, doesn't he? Look, I couldn't end the video off without showing you guys something. I, I posted it on Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I'm gonna start posting teasers of all the trucks that we do on YouTube on Instagram before the videos come out. So at that wide bowtie on Instagram, go follow your boy. 
I want, I want to show you guys something cool. Uh, I told you that by the end of the video, we'd have rose gold wheels, and we do have rose gold wheels to show you. All the accent pieces are done, the hitch is done, everything's done. I'm picking up some other pieces tomorrow, but the wheels especially is what I wanted to show you guys. But first, KG1 dropped off a set of 26 by 16 tridents today. Jake's a little salty behind the camera on these. Look at that motherfucker. Look at that damn thing. Gosh. 26 by 16 trident. I'm filled with regret. These are going on a, uh, a charcoal gray Tahoe from Tennessee in about two weeks. 26 by 16 KG1 Trident, 35, 15, 50, 26 Fury MTs. Nine inch McGoy's lift kit. That's gonna be a sexy, sexy Tahoe, that's for sure. So I got those I definitely wanted you guys to see before the video is over with. But most importantly, the moment of the day, it's kind of slick, you like that? The 26 by 14 KG1 Tridents, rose gold. Per customer request, we did the rose gold face, rose gold back lip, and then we got the polished lip. Um, and then we're gonna have the rose gold center cap, either the brown lug nuts or chrome lug nuts, whichever he prefers. The, the polish on these wheels turned out amazing. Huge shout out to RTP Customs, coming through with an amazing powder job. It's one of the, in my opinion, the coolest build that I've ever done, I've ever been a part of personally. And I think this is this one's gonna be a statement. This one is 100% gonna be a statement for the shop and just for, uh, for KG1 as well. So I'm not gonna show you guys too much. I'm not gonna show you guys any of the accent pieces. I'm not gonna show you guys, uh, well, I guess you guys did see the lift kit. Did we ever actually film the lift kit? I don't think we have ever actually filmed the lift kit. This is the, the lift kit that's going on the truck. You got that nine inch McGoy's. The brown color to match the truck. The, the truck is outside. So you got the brown and the rose gold together. So the brown lift kit to match the truck, all of the accents inside of the lift kit will be rose gold to match the wheels. I'm excited. I think it's gonna look really, really good. You're, this, this is one of those builds you're either gonna love it or you're gonna hate it. There's no in between. So in my, I already love it. I, I'm throwing it out there, I already love it. But let me know what you guys think in the comments. The truck is in the shop as we speak right now. The truck is behind this wall in the shop. They've already torn it down. We got a couple extra pieces that went out to powder coat this morning. And then I'm actually going to pick up a couple extra final pieces for it tomorrow. And then uh, in the next video, you guys will see the full truck get assembled. So follow me on Instagram at that white bow tie for updates. I'll see you guys next time. Let's get this bread. Get this bread.